Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a review on the Chris Cosmetics Momager collection. Oh my god, guys, I'm so gagged because I got added to the Kylie PR list. Like, bitch, I'm sorry. Um, so I'm super excited about this collection. The packaging is literally everything. So if, if you guys want my 100% honest review on the Kylie Cosmetics Momager collection, then keep on watching. If you guys are not subscribed to my channel, if you make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell. I post videos every single week and you guys should definitely stick around. It's a lot of fun over here. Without further ado, let's get into the video. She's gorgeous. She's stunning. I've honestly, like this is probably the coolest packaging I've ever seen Kelly come out with. I love the cartoon versions. This actually came with like a middle finger keychain, which I immediately added to my car keys. The 10% sunglasses and like this and like this, it's everything. I like live, breathe and die for this collection. So let's move into eyeshadow. I have my base done. I know that this is a highlighter palette and this is an eyeshadow palette and then we have some lip stuff. So we're gonna start with eyes and that is this iconic 10% sunglasses eyeshadow palette. Look at how cute that is, oh my god. First impressions, it's a little tinier in person, but the packaging is just sickening, even on the inside. Look at that like white and black. If you guys watch Game with the Kardashians, you'll see that in her like foyer area. It's like, she has like this white and black tile, so super iconic. And the shade names in this, guys, ugh, I live. It's I Love Myself Gorgeous, It's an Emergency, Very Nice, Haters, Vodka Tonic, Payback's a Bitch, Impressed, 10%, probably the most iconic name. I'm watching you, talent, does it come in black? Here's the little palette. Yeah, girl, it's definitely a lot smaller in person. Look at how cute that is though, oh my god. Okay, so let's just start with I love myself because I love myself. And I'm gonna take a flat top brush. I'm going to go in. It's a little annoying, it doesn't have a mirror, but that's okay, I'll live with it. Let's take a fluffy blending brush and let's go with It's an Emergency. Okay, girl, it's very cool toned. Y'all know I like my warm tones, but cool tones are cute too, I guess. So I brought you guys a little bit closer so you can see what is happening. I'm just popping this into my crease. I've tried Kylie shadows before and I like them. Like I think the formula is good. I think that they're pretty easy to blend. And this one, I'm not really seeing anything different. The main thing I look for in a shadow, other than does it show up on my eyelid, that is it a going patchy as I'm blending it in, and this one isn't, so that's good. And I'm actually excited to play with some cool tones because I haven't done that in a bit. I'm gonna take, take just a little smudging brush in that black shade. And guys, black, it can get really muddy really quick, so you gotta be careful. I like to do, use a little bit at a time. Personally, cool tones like aren't my favorite. I don't mind them, but like if I'm doing like a look, I would go for like a more warm tone look. But Kris Jenner, if you know Kris Jenner, she's all about her cool tones. I mean, she's all about that cool tone smoky eye, so I'm not surprised that a lot of the shades in this palette are cool toned. But she has some very pretty shimmers in here. I live for the shimmers. And I don't hate cool tone smoky eyes at all. Like, have you guys seen that one meme that's like, the devil works hard, but Kris Jenner works harder. I like live for that because I feel like it's so true. I love Kris Jenner. Okay, so I feel like that's it for the, I keep wanting to, like I keep looking at this, like thinking there's a mirror, there's not. Okay, I'm liking how the crease looks. Let's add a lid shade. I'm thinking we'll go with Vodka Tonic, cause, or Haters, but I'm thinking Haters might be better for like brow bone and inner corner highlight. So I'm gonna just do Vodka Tonic. Like, Wow, that like foiled on my eyes really easily. Actually, I'm gonna take the shade I'm watching you. It's like this like gun barrel, whatever you should call it, like this gun barrel gray. Let's kind of blend the lid shade and the um, crease shades together. When I added the shade I'm watching you, it did get a little patchy, nothing too bad, but like, I don't know if that was like my blending thing or like the shadow or something, but who knows? Let's just move on. I'm gonna go back in with that shade. I love myself. Oh wow, I love saying that. <laughs> I just put that on my brow bone to make the shadow look a little bit more blended. I'm gonna take the shade Haters and I'm going to highlight the inner corner and brow bone. So I'm gonna finish the other half camera and add some lashes and we'll be right back. Okay guys, we're back. Let's do the lower lash line. Oh why guys, I always forget about the lower lash line. Okay, so I wanna take this shade, it's an emergency again, and I'm gonna pop that on the lower lash line. 
And then I want to take the shade I'm watching you. I'm going to deepen from like the outer corner to like the middle. And then does it come in black? I'm going to do just on the very outer edge. I'm going to take a beauty blender and just kind of go right under that. All right, I'm definitely feeling some liner. So I'm going to take the Anastasia Dark Side Waterproof Gel Liner and pop it in there. Guys, there we go. This eye's complete. Wait, girl. <laughs> to say the least, look at how fucking gorgeous this eye looks. Guys, I promise my lash is not wonky. It's just the glue here on top. Okay, guys. So, eyes are done. I'm obsessed. They look fucking bomb. I really need to do cool tones. I usually don't do cool tone smoky eyes or really play with cool tones, but whenever I actually do, I absolutely love how it looks and I absolutely love how it comes out and I need to like do more. So I don't know why I like never do cool tones, but here's a cool tone smoky eye for y'all and I fucking live for it. It's so fucking good. The 10% eyeshadow palette was everything. I fucking live for it, but I'll give you my final impressions at the end. All right, guys, next up is the highlighter palette. The fucking packaging, I can't. I, like, live for it. Kylie always kills it with packaging, I feel. You're doing amazing, sweetie. <laughs> oh, shit, there's blushes, too. I didn't know this was, like, a blush palette because I already added a little bit of blush, but we can add more. So we have It's Snowing Pussy Willows. We have Money Doesn't Grow on Trees. We have your sisters going to jail. Oh my god, yes, I'm so happy as a shade. I raised you on mac and cheese. Fuck this fucking thing. The, the, the names gag me every time. The palette looks absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna use the shade to highlight and I'm gonna use both of these shades for blush. Ooh, that's pretty. I love orange coral corally blushes a lot. So these blushes are everything. Come on, Chris Jenner. Okay. Now time for the highlight. Okay, the highlight is blinding. There it is. There's the highlight. There's the eyes. So she did come out with a lip collection. I love how it's spelled with a K. Of course, Kris Jenner would do that. And it has a bunch of liquid lipsticks. I'm gonna insert like a, the swatches of these, but I'm not gonna swatch all of them on the lips. There's literally eight of these, so I'm not gonna swatch eight lipsticks. Sorry about it. But what I will put on my lips is the Kris Jenner lip liner and lipstick, and again, Fucking kills it with the packaging. So let's go in with the lip liner first. Okay, so it's like a mauve. The color's pretty. The formula, again, I like, y'all know Kylie has a great lipstick formula, so nothing new there. And then here is the lipstick, and oh my god, it has middle fingers all over it. Alright, guys, so. Ah! Alright, guys, so, what the fuck? All right, guys, so my final impressions for the Kylie Cosmetics Momager collection is it is approved by me. I absolutely love it. I love the eyeshadows. Let's start with eyeshadow. I love this eyeshadow palette. I do wish there was more matte shades, but the formula is good, and I also love all the shimmer shades in this look. I absolutely love how my eyeshadow came out. It's very Kris Jenner, the cool tone, smoky eye. It got me to play with some cool tones. Guys, I look so cute with cool tones. Like, I don't know why I don't play with them more often. Next, the highlighting palette. The highlighting palette, you guys. The highlight was very pretty. I love the blush. I love the names. The pins are freaking huge. <laughs> but yeah, I really like the blush. These blushes are very pretty, and I like the highlight as well. The highlight was also very pretty. And last but not least, the lipsticks. We already know Kylie has a bomb lipstick formula. I really like the lipstick. I like how it looks on my lips. I don't know if I would have chose this color for this eyeshadow look, but... This is a very pretty mob though. I do like this I will use it in the future. And come on guys, you cannot even sit there and say the packaging is not freaking amazing. Look at the little fingers. So this does launch Sunday on Mother's Day. So if you guys are interested in the collection, go get yourself the Momager collection. Thank you all so much for watching this video. If you liked it, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Also, subscribe to my YouTube channel down below. We're so close to a million. So... And I'll see you guys later in the next one.